So I've been in practice for over 16 years, very high volume surgery at my last practice. And so when I made the decision to start an office-based surgery, there was a lot of fear there because I didn't really know the uh, anesthesia type, uh, IV, uh, a lot of retro bulbar blocks that I was doing in my old practice. But the benefit of the office-based surgery is that in the last year since I've been open, I haven't done any uh, retro bulbar blocks. It's all been oral anesthesia. So it's been super sort of user-friendly for our patients. Patients just have said that it's been a great experience for them. It was very different than their first dive. It was done at the other facility that I used to do surgery at where we had to do a, an IV in everyone. And so uh, in, in select cases, obviously, you can still do IV uh, for those serious cases, but the cases that I've chosen to do in my office-based surgery have been very straightforward. So with office-based surgery, there's two types. There's class A and class B type cases. Class A is when you're just using oral uh, sedation, such as Valium or a MKO melt, as opposed to class B, that's intravenous or, or IV sedation. We are both a class A and a class B outpatient surgery uh, center in, in my facility. But in the last year, I really only had to use the uh, class A or just oral sedation.